Edmonton's only rock, K97. Subdivisions. A lucky man before that, Emerson, Lake and Palmer. And David Bowie with fame. It's a couple minutes after six. Where the hell is he? Oh, here he uh, comes. Are you on the air? Yeah. On the air? Yeah, over what? here. Oh. The mic button right there. Hello. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Good morning uh, there. Good morning. <laughs> Better late than never. I guess you might say. Got yeah. it together at least. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So how you doing, Mark? Really good. I'm really looking forward to the game. Oh, yeah. I the big too. game. That's going to be a lot of fun. Oh, I've got my skate sharpened. Mm -hmm. I've got a new stick. Mm -hmm. And I've got 15 cases of beer for the end of the game. I think I'm ready. Well... <laughs> Do you Skate sharpened a new stick and 15 cases of beer. Yeah, well, I'll bring some for you, too. I'll bring the police. <laughs> <laughs> a wild man, Mark. A wild man. That's who you are. Our time is a couple after 6 o'clock. It's the loop on your Wednesday. And One Horse Blue with One Horse Blue from K97. From American Fool, John Cougar and Hurt So Good, a song that he played just after he got beaned in the head with a beer bottle at a Shh. concert. <laughs> Came out with a hard hat on and sang that. George Thorogood started off the set with one bourbon, one scotch, and one beer. And Mark, do you think you're going to need that, the next K97 Dirty Sox hockey team, uh, hockey game? Many times over, Donna. <laughs> I tell you, I was out all yesterday afternoon actually practicing. That's right, and we, I... must, we must tell everyone that you are the goalie. Well, yeah, and I feel bad. We've lost three in a row now. <laughs> well, we're looking for number four. It's coming up on <laughs> December the 12th. December the 12th against Carling O'Keefe. That should be a good game. It's in the Coliseum yet. Big class hockey game here. Holy crow. Do you think you can manage to skate all the way down the ice? I'm just staying in the net. I'm not skating all the way down the net. I'll leave that for the other suckers. No. No, we, we you know, if there's any p people out there that have uh, ice time, like to play us. Uh, we're we're not very good, so we're no slap shot, no body contact. So it's hockey. just basic hockey. Yeah, no mm -hmm. rough stuff. Mm -hmm. And uh, call us weekdays, 428-8597. The Lost Treasures Weekend starts Friday afternoon on K97. Good morning, it's 8 after 2. Coming up on the set, we've got music from Bruce Springsteen and Rush. Right now, ZZ Top from K97. Gosh, I like that album. That is Rush from Signals and the Analog Kit from K97. The Boss in there with Hungry Heart, Twilight Zone from Golden Earring, and ZZ Top with Tush. It's about 25 after 2. Good morning. You with Mark Summers. Coming up in the next set, we got music from Black Sabbath and Bob Seger. few games in the NHL. Three, a matter of fact. It's uh, Montreal. A defeat Winnipeg 9-4. Chicago got by New Jersey 3-1. And Calgary and Minnesota skated to a three-all tie. Owners have had a couple of days off. The next game is uh, at the Coliseum 7.30, and that's on Wednesday as they take on Philadelphia. Wayne Gretzky once again in the news. He extended his point scoring streak to 26 games. He's the second longest ever in the NHL. Montreal's Guy Lafleur, who holds the uh, mark at 28 games. A record that Gretzky can tie at home this Saturday against Calgary Flames. And a record that he can beat, will beat, hopefully, a Sunday night against Los Angeles. You've got the new K97 sweatshirt on under that blouse. Oh, and you know something, Bernard? You can get yours at Peter Wolf. All right. 227, this is Mark Summers. Coming up, as I mentioned, Black Sabbath. Right now, Peter Gabriel, Shock the Monkey, from K97. Play, play, play. K97, with Pink Floyd. Several species of small furry animals gathered together in a cave and grooving with a pick. It's almost as easy as saying you're intoxicated with exuberance of your own reciprocity, right? Mm-hmm. Dire Straits from Love Over Gold with Telegraph Road before that. Six after three now. How you doing this morning? Good. That's Bad Company at Rock and Roll Fantasy. Don Henley before that. You better hang up from his latest uh, I Can't Stand Still is first, actually. Van Halen, you really got me. And we started off the set with Eric Clapton heading back to Slow Hand. A track called Cocaine. Hi, Donna. Good Howdy. Interesting day on the open circuit. That's uh, this right. 
Right. Morning. We were just talking about that. Yeah. It's music day. Yeah, and talking about good music, mm-hmm. Led Zeppelin, I think, will be the top of the subject. I think so, uh, yeah. The latest album, yeah. Super Tramp, and Kate so, Bush. Yeah, Kate Bush, a little something for people who like a little different sort of music. Ted Kennedy is wild over that album. Yeah, he gave it in the record rate or what, four and a, a half? Four and a half. Good morning. It's six minutes after two now. This is Mark Summers. Coming up, we got music from Super Tramp. Right now, music from The Doors, L.A. Woman from K97. Signals, that's Rush from K97. New World Man, forever together from ABC. Sticks with lights and a hard act to follow. Split ends, minute after six, Bruce Kenyon's in. Good morning, Mark. You morning. in the Christmas spirit yet now that we're yeah. into December? What, 24 more days left to get presents? And I have none yet. You yes. haven't? Well, no. I've worked in mine. Matter of fact, I went to the parents yesterday, and mm-hmm. they had their tree up. They've had it up Wait a now. minute, wait a minute. They Since have... November the 4th? Your mother puts her tree up on November the 4th? And she keeps the curtains closed so the neighbors don't look and stare. <laughs> <laughs> she does it. Why would she put her tree up that early? Just to get into the spirit? Well, yeah. She plays a Christmas Really music. loves... Is it a live tree? No. Like, no. Good thing would be dead. <laughs> yeah, right. Hello, Mata. Across from the Riviera at 54th Avenue and 103rd Street. See your newspaper for more details. Three minutes now after 6 o'clock as we get underway for a Wednesday. Bruce Kenyon with you on K97. Temperature's about minus 9 degrees, and here's Rough Trade. Music from the Beatles' Revolver album on K97. Just before that, Thin Lizzy, a classic tune, Boys Are Back in Town. Survivor, Eye of the Tiger, from their debut release. Secret information from Chilliwack's Opus 10. They'll be in town December the 10th, right, Mark? With the Blushing Brides? You betcha. (laughs) And Angel City started off the set with Face the Day from the Dark Room album. It's 5 after 2, and Mark Summers is in. Well. Yeah, I know. You're going to rib me. (laughs) No, your episodes of playing pool. (laughs) Listen, I'm rusty. I'm rusty. If that's what you call rusty. (laughs) You mentioned before we played pool that you could play. Yeah. What what happened? (laughs) (laughs) I told you I was rusty. I haven't played pool since September. Uh, uh, Mark and I got together to play some pool, and uh, yeah, and um, I I sort of was funny? wiped right off oh. the board. <laughs> funny, a hundred to five. <laughs> but yeah, next right. time it's going to be better, right? Eh? That's right. I won't be rusty anymore. Yeah, right. Hey, Fat Albert. Monday to Friday, Saturday till five thirty. The six weeks of Christmas continues at Craig Cole's Jewelry Warehouse, Kitty Corner from the Brick. Should be a lot of fun. Donna and myself going at another pool game. She's going to try it. I won't. I'll still win. No problem. <laughs> Yellow shot from Zeppelin coming up right now. This is Judas Priest from K97. From their first album back to 1978, The Cars and My Best Friend's Girl on K97. A little bit of John Lennon before that across the universe. You got lucky from Tom Petty's latest release and we started off the set with the romantics. And what I like about you, what I like about them is their wonderful red leather suits. And I had a chance to uh, talk to Jimmy Marino's one time and I asked him what they did with their leather suits once they finished with them. And well, I guess they didn't do too much because they're kind of skinny guys, he said, so that their suits don't fit too many people. You asked really important questions. <laughs> No. Well, I, I'm curious. I what really do you like do with your suits, suits after you get out of. Them? <laughs> like I'm in a kinky mood. Now I'd like to find it. No. Hey, anyway, you, you missed a good game. Sorry, you're turning red. You missed a good game last night. Yeah, you were raving yesterday about the Oilers, and you figured geez, they Ooh. were going to win, you know, and stuff. But they, it was a close game. Yeah, I predicted seven-one, but uh, it was three-two. Really tense because they pulled their goalie. Uh, St. Louis did, and it was really tense for the last six seconds. Oh, no. But when when do the Oilers play next? Uh, they're away for two games. They play Los Angeles. The guys are we skunked 7-3, so I can <laughs> hardly wait for that one.